we will start the discussion of convex functions, with convex sets. When we have a convex set, for every two points in this set, for every value of theta in the closed interval from 0 to 1, the following condition is satisfied. What this condition essentially means, is that the line segment between any two points in this set, must also lie in this set. For the example of a convex set, consider the figure on the left, no matter which two points we pick from this set, the line segment between these points, will always lie in this set. For the counterexample, consider the figure on the right. As we can see, there exists a pair of points in this set, for which the line segment between them, does not lie in the set. Let's now discuss the convex functions. When the domain of the function is a convex set, the function is convex, if it satisfies the following inequality. Geometrically, this inequality means, that the line segment between any two points on the graph of the function, lies on, or above this graph. For example, a parabola, is a famous convex function, and it satisfies the previously stated condition. A sinusoid however, is not a convex function, since we can find two such points on the graph, where a line connecting them, does not lie on, or above the function's graph. Convex functions, have properties, that are very useful in optimization. For example, multivariable convex functions, have a Hessian that is positive semi-definite everywhere. These kinds of functions, have no saddle points, and all their local minima, are global minima at the same time. These properties make convex optimization especially successful.